Is your high-performance computing code ready to scale and you need to learn the best way to schedule cloud resources and manage execution for your workloads? Do you need to learn cost optimizations or minimize the runtime for your HPC workloads? We'll go through an example of how to use Google Cloud Batch for an application using message passing interface. My name is Lee Gates. I focus on performance-sensitive workloads, availability, and efficiency by working with our product and engineering teams in Google Cloud. The example I'll show is how to bring a weather forecasting MPI-based application to Google Cloud using Batch to schedule and manage resources. You can review this sample application at our GitHub repository. Okay, so the first part of building our HPC application using Batch means we need to enable the Batch API services. So take just a moment. And the second step uh, is to load up the file store that you're going to use um, and I've already done that so let's take a look at the file store in my environment you can see there it's in the US best West 1B zone and so that's the machine that we will use or the instance we will use for our file store and then the following step is to create our console so in this case it's uh, in the same zone as the file store and using the C2 standard 60 um, and that will uh, start up here momentarily there it is it's running and now we're in our console so the next step that we need to do is to mount uh, the share that we have created for our file store so become root Create the share location. Let's go get our share and mount it. And go to our share location. And from here, we will configure the environment by cloning in. SPAC, uh, create a source the environment when it's all done. This will take a few minutes. And now we are ready to run our test data set. This will take about a minute and a half. Let's go start pulling down the larger complete data set to prepare for our large test using batch. Okay, I've just logged into gcloud and have myself authenticated. Now I can go in and create the image, the instance template. And it's being created. And so the next step we would need to do is to prepare the file for running and put it on the uh, the script for running and put it on the file instant the file store instance okay that's our script that will load on each of the jobs and so now what we need to do is we're ready to create our job file. And we are ready to run our batch job. So let's do that. So here we can see our job has been submitted. So our job has been scheduled. You can see all of our parameters there. And we'll be able to see it running soon. So here's where we're going to wrap up our demo today. We've shown you a batch example. 
uh, of our weather forecasting application running to completion all the way from setting it up to um, to getting a successful run across four different nodes. For those of you interested in uh, seeing our uh, examples in our repository, uh, it's on github.com, Google Cloud Platform, batch-samples.